Glenn, let me turn really quickly to Jack Smith's other investigation. Uh, tomorrow, Evan Corcoran, the president's attorney, former president's attorney, Trump's uh, attorney, is expected to testify before the grand jury as soon as, uh, I guess, tomorrow in the Mar-a-Lago documents case. What do you make of that? Why is that significant? You know, it's hugely consequential. We don't often have criminal defense attorneys testify about their clients' crimes except when the crime fraud exception applies, which causes the attorney-client privilege to evaporate. I think the most interesting thing now moving forward is whether Evan Corcoran will plead the Fifth Amendment, will invoke his own Fifth Amendment right against self-incrimination because he believes he was complicit in Donald Trump's crimes, or if he believes that he was an unwitting dupe. Donald Trump was giving him false information, and he was simply certifying it and passing it on to the federal government. Then his truthful testimony would not incriminate him. He'd have no reason to plead the fifth, and he can testify and, frankly, become one of the most sharply incriminating witnesses against his former client, Donald Trump. So even though the grand jury proceedings are secret, so we may not know these things right away, I suspect we will know them before too long.